Hi there and welcome back. So today I'm here to um, do something a little bit different. Um, I have entered a couple of times that I've um, been working on something and uh, yeah, this is this is it. So it's a collaboration uh, with myself and Nanine at Collage Type. Um, I wanted to create um, an Alice journal and um, yeah she definitely uh, saw saw my vision and um, we've been working very hard so it, it's going to be partly in my shop and partly in Nanine's shop we've split it up that um, Nanine's got the journal kit I've got uh, the file folder kit and then we've got two like embellishment um, add-ons in, in each kit. There'll also be some freebies which will be available on uh, my Buy Me A Coffee and there will be um, some different ones which are available um, on my Patreon. So these will go live tomorrow in in both of our shops. I'm not sure about the, the timing, I don't know, because. Uh, Nanine's in in America, so I get I guess as soon as you know we both get up type thing, um, we'll we'll put them put them in. So it's probably going to be a long video because I really want to show it off. Um, I've had it printed out for a few weeks now. Um, I want to get it you know cut up and uh, ready to use. So. What month are we? April. So this will come out on the 1st of May. And um, I've asked three other ladies if they would uh, work with the kit through um, through the month. We're going to stagger it. Um, so I'm going to go uh, first. No, Rita Jensen is going to go first. Um, I'm going to go second. Denise from Denise Junk Journals UK is third and then Mandy from Sunflowers and Doors um, will, will be on the last uh, week. So shall I show it you? So I'm going to show you what's available in Nanine's shop um, first. So this is um, Nanine's. So this is um, the journal kit and two of the add-ons so you can see it's it's jam packed um so we've got the lovely um alice obviously this can be used as um you know your journal cover or a notebook cover or you can shrink it down and make it into a journal card or it can be um you know a big tall um journal card or just a page in in your journal so I've backed it um, with some of the other papers and these are papers from uh, the Alice in Wonderland book. So here's the journal pages. So it's got a really nice um, tone to it. Um, when, when I was thinking about colours I wanted it like a peachy pink, a pale blue. Uh, sepias but I wanted the sepias to have um, a, a peachy um, colour to them and yeah they, they're perfect so we've got part of the story on this side and then a lined side and I've backed it with that one same with this one I think there's four with um, pictures this side and four with pictures the other side if I remember correctly I've printed these on 160 GSM um, manila colored um, paper so that's that one and this one got this nice um, aged look which I really love two I think there's two yeah and that one and then oh i think it must be five then yeah five going that side and then uh going this side and that one the 
kit is called Down the Rabbit Hole. I forgot all about mentioning that. <laughs> So we've got plenty of, of journal uh, pages. Okay, so that's the actual uh, journal pages. And then we've got a collage sheet, which is lovely. We've got the blues and the peaches. We've got the clocks at the back and, and numbers, the harlequins, and some uh, florals and bits of paper from the Alice book. And then we've got the Drink Me and some Alice Ephemera there. That's um, the ledger piece that I've backed um, the pages in. That's um, one of the book pages. Well, it's two different ones joined, joined together. Another collage sheet. That's all in the sepias. And then we move on to uh, the ephemera. So I wanted the ephemera, so that one's, uh, you know, upside down when you're looking at it. But if you cut it that way, you've got um, a landscape. So you can have it as a as a flip up um, journal card. You can make it into a notebook or you can cut these two and, and do the same. Um, with them or you can cut them separately and round each one we've got this nice uh, border just to to keep that uh, color I wanted the color to be um, very subtle um, I did toy with wanting the whole thing in sepia but I thought just um, you know a little bit of color um, will will be nice so that's that one and we've got that one And that one, and that one. So four pages of uh, journal cards. So that's sixteen journal cards. Like I say, massive, massive kits. Um, I really enjoyed, um, yeah, creating, creating it with with Nanine. And um, I just couldn't stop. Um, so we've got two two pockets here. We've got um, a corner pocket here, and then a tall corner pocket here. Okay. And then we've got two corner pockets here, which would go that way. You could keep those uh, together. We've got this tall um, one. And then we've got this strip here, which can be used as a belly band or as um, decoration. And then these are the add-on uh, kits. So it's just, you know, small fussy cut um, kit. So we've got some uh, desserts for um, Alice's tea party. And then we've got the, the, the flag banners. It says Alice's Tea Party. So that's that one. I've also printed these out uh, two to a page to get different um, sizes. I think I have uh, printed a couple out four to a page as well, you know, to get really small um, embellishments. So that's that one. Then we've got a page of teacups and teapots. Again, I've printed this out in different um, sizes. Then we've got a couple of hearts, which you can use as embellishments or you could use them as little pockets or, or side tucks. And then we've got a couple of um, roses and then we've got a couple of vintage um, queen playing cards, queen of hearts. I'm not sure uh, which fussy cuts which, but um, yeah, these are the, the two what's in, in the neons. So we've got um, some clocks and a um, pocket watch, some florals and then the, the drink me and the rabbit <laughs> hurrying, hurrying off. And we've got lots of um, little, um, you know, 
quotes and, and things from from the Alice book again we've brought that that color um, in I've printed this off in in several sizes um, as well these bigger ones you can use as, as little uh, pockets and little tucks so we've got lots of cool ones <laughs> and we've got two my um, printer cut off there but there's none actually missing it just makes it look as if there is got two mini little uh, file folders there and then um, I should have printed at the back of that so there was something at the back so beautiful colour that's um, you know virgin on being terracotta, uh, terracotta beautiful um and then we've got some some circles in two different sizes and some other uh, little labels love these ones uh, from the book pages and we've got a sheet of um the the florals that have been used in in the background uh pages And another, these are, you know, my diary, my thoughts. You are invited. Drink me, Mad Hatter, memories, ideas, Alice. So that is um, the kits that will be going in Nanine's shop. Okay, and these are the ones uh, that will be going into mine. So again, this can be used as, as a journal cover, um, notebook cover or as a large journal card or shrunk down to make um, another journal card I don't know if you can see here but um, there's just tinges of, of blue in there and just running through through a dress very very pretty then I've backed that one again uh, with a book page it's a different uh, book page to the other one then we've got uh, the chess <laughs> board. Absolutely love this. Just the right amount of uh, grunge on there. So these are printed on 100 GSM um, oh, manila paper. Um, that one was on 160. So we've got um, a backing uh, paper got the, the clocks faintly in the background we've got some blues coming through and some of the some of the peaches and there we have it again with more added to it so we've got the numbers and the harlequins and brought the color in um, a lot more obviously I've gone for the um, the landscape the portrait ones sorry um because i like doing folios and things like that so i i do like plenty of of um, portrait ones so here we go again similar um but with the clocks taken taken out i've got this script um coming coming in beautiful uh wallpapers in the background and then that's plain you know without without the numbers so that's that one then we've got this blue one with the um, florals in the background and we've got it in peach <laughs> and we've got it in in the sepias and then that's got a bit of everything on it and we've got it playing in in the peach. Love that. I'll say I'm really happy uh, with the with the colours. I'm not sure um, how the camera's going to be picking it up. They they're quite delicate um, colours. So that's those two. And then we've got um, a collage sheet and another collage sheet. Um, a backing paper which is just uh, graph paper and then 
another part of the, the book, which is great for, for collage. And then uh, here's the, the tags. Cut them joined together so you can, you know, use them singular, double, or as a, a trio. And um, yeah, I wanted these um, toppers for a change. And um, I wanted the rounded um, corners on them. And I thought if they're tall, you can then, you know, print them out two to a page. So they're half, um, half the size. Or you could do them four to, to a page. Um, so that's those ones. Not about those. Yeah, I've done those in the grid. These are on 200 uh, GSM Manila card. So that's that one. And the third page. Love that blue one. Wanted to keep so many, you know, pretty plain that they can be um, decorated up yourself. You can always cut uh, these out, and these would then, you know, make more uh, journal cards. Or if you'd printed them out two to a page, these would be even smaller, so they'd make nice embellishments. And here we've got two bands which can either be used as belly bands or as um, page decoration or ripped up as, you know, some tear, um, like washi. Then we've got two little pockets here and then a little corner pocket there. These are on 160 GSM. Again, we've got another two bands, two pockets and a corner pocket uh, there. These can obviously be used as journal cards. And then this is um, the embellishment. So this is um, an add-on. So we've got the chess pieces some keys and some uh, locks. That's that one. I've done these on 160 GSM as well. I've got more keys, some florals and some clocks. And a little um, man. <laughs> I don't quite know. A card man. Um, then we've got um, a couple of doors which obviously again you know you can shrink, shrink down um, and I've really really small but I love these two two doors so that's that one then we've got some playing cards which would be great for um, decorating up I think I'll have a lot of fun uh, with them and this one's got its own sayings they're to totally different to to the ones in the other kit I am under no obligation to make sense to you. <laughs> What's up that on my um, on my office door? And we've got some labels. Okay. And we've got some lovely uh, frames, a couple of ornate frames. And there's plenty of space. If you wanted to, you know, put put a hinge, uh, flip flip that one up, flip that one down. So that's that one. And we've got some more bunting in this one. This one's um, not got, you know, the writing on, whereas the others, the other one had Alice's tea party. And on this one, we've got some um, stamps. And we've got a page of uh, different uh, thicknesses of washi strips. So that is um, the kits that will be um, in, in my shop. <laughs> so I will put um, both um, our links in the description. I shall just show you um, a couple of the freebies. Okay, so we've got um, a sheet of four postcards. Again, you can cut those out that way and have them um, that way, or you can cut them out that way and have them, yeah, or cut them out singularly. So I think that way they've got lots of um, 
use as my um I'd put the paper in wonky and then we've got um some backing papers um I ummed and awed if I wanted the black florals or if I wanted these white florals and I wanted both really uh, but the black just slightly won but I really still did like um these papers so i thought if if you know these are then uh, a freebie uh, you could change out you know your black ones and and use the these white ones or or both so we've got one in the peach um one in the blue and then one in the sepia and we've got six um tags here Again, you can keep those uh, together or you could keep them together that way. And we've got a couple more um, sheets. So that is that. Is that. Um, just want to thank um, Nanine for um, letting me take, take the reins. Um, when when we started the kit, um, I didn't tell her what the theme was because um, I, I didn't want um, a mind being clouded by it's it's Alice. So um, I started off with, um, you know, the colour palette um, and we started building uh, the plainer um, colours, the plainer backgrounds. Um, oh, but I can't find one now. So you know, um, like like this, I said, um, you know, peaches and, and blues. We've got the right tone, and then I said, um, oh yeah, just add some numbers to it, and oh maybe a bit of that harlequin, um, and kind of went like that for for a while to get um all of the backing papers. Um, even putting the clocks in, I still, I still didn't say that it was, it was Alice. Um, it wasn't until we got to, uh, I think the collage sheets, um, that that I did say that that it was um, for Alice, <laughs> and um, yeah, I I thought that worked worked better. Um, I'm not too sure. Um, I, <laughs> it was probably working totally back to front um finanine but um yeah i wanted to see see how it, it developed and i didn't want my mind clouding either because i thought you know as soon as we start introducing alice everything's going to go crazy and it's going to be alice 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 um so i thought getting the backing papers um, ready and the colours and and things uh, was was important because I'd I'd got a real Pacific um you know colour tones that that I wanted to to use so thank you so much uh, Nanine it's been a really um, exciting uh, project I do hope that um, <laughs> you'll do another one with me in the future when you've when you've got over it and also thank you to to Rita, Denise and Mandy who's going to be uh, showcasing the kit um, I really uh, appreciate it um, I know they're excited to get to get started and they've given me some lovely uh, feedback on the kit um, I think quite clearly um, the next time I, I do a kit I think I really need to look at, at the pockets that page is fine but um, you know I can now see that there's a lot of uh, wasted space and um, yeah on I mean that one's fine uh, some of the element pages um, that one's fine they're a bit patchy so um, but yeah, th that was the good thing, like Nanine did let me, you know, she didn't say, well, this is the way I do it and, and things. She did really let me um, take the reins. So thank you so, so much. I've absolutely loved um, doing it. So I think, I think that's it. I'm going to switch the camera off on time and be like, oh, I never said such and such or such and such. So I'm really looking forward to seeing Rita. Um, 
use the kit uh, tomorrow. Uh, she should be starting. I will um, obviously put uh, Rita, Denise's and Mandy's uh, links. And um, yeah, we're, we're to get the kit. Um, t tomorrow, which is, is the first, uh, the freebies will be um, available uh, wherever, you know, I'm putting, putting them. And um, yeah, I'm excited to see um, if any of you create with it. If you do, you're more than welcome to come and share your photos or your links to your videos on the Facebook group. I will also uh, put that in in the description. So yeah, I'm so excited. Uh, thank you so much for, for sitting through this and, and watching. Um, I did want to um, you know, go through through e each page. It's um, very very exciting. Uh, it, yeah, very exciting. You know, to have a thought in your head, and um, yeah, then it's um, in front of you, and yeah, it's just just perfect. So thank you so much, and I shall see you tomorrow. Bye for now.